What's up there, rail fans? Well, I am here in Pelham, and this time I'm out catching trains under better weather circumstances. The previous day was really stormy. We even had tornado warnings in certain areas. Just taking a look right here, you can see some of the fallen limbs and branches from that storm. These winds were in excess of 60 miles per hour in some areas, some that were enough to actually blow some trees down. And speaking of trees, take a look at this house here, I realized that the ones that were surrounding it are gone. I was wondering why the sky was a lot more noticeable lately. These guys are really trying their best to get this house up and running as that dessert restaurant they mentioned. But for right now, what's not going is nothing on the tracks. Looking at the SNA right there, that's the Murray signal and the Helena signal way there in the background. Right now, red in both directions. Well, at least to my knowledge. For northbound, nothing's coming. But there is something coming on the Lineville in a few minutes. And in a few minutes, Josh had joined me. And joining us right now is Q647, coming from Chicago, Illinois, bound for Rice Yard, Waycross, Georgia. And with a lot of power. Definitely a power transfer. Well now, no DPU on this one. Usually they would have them on these trains nowadays. And that goes double for this one that sneaked up on us. Here comes Q519, bound for Mobile. We do know there is another train to the south coming this way, but he'll be held at Longview for a few minutes. But we're done here, losing a lot of light, and at 411.0 here on the SNA South, thanks for watching. Until the next milepost.